first time I saw the TJ Cruiser, the first thought that came to my mind was, this looks like a toolbox on wheels. And true enough, the letter T in TJ stands for toolbox, and then J stands for joy because I assume you'll experience a lot of joy traveling in the TJ Cruiser. Toolbox joy cruiser may not make a lot of sense from a semantic or grammatical point of view, but we expect no less than perfect English from a Japanese concept vehicle. It seems like the goal of, of the designers was to create a vehicle with as few curves as possible. And if that was the goal, they achieved it. The TJ Cruiser is one of the boxiest looking vehicles at the Philippine International Motor Show next to the new Jiminy. The fact that they were able to create the futuristic looking vehicle using mostly straight lines is an impressive feat. It's supposed to be a cross between a van and an SUV. It has the roominess of a van and the rugged looks of an SUV. The hood, the roof, and the fenders have scratch resistant coating. The TJ Cruiser is powered by a 2 liter naturally aspirated gasoline engine coupled to a hybrid system. The exact figures are unknown. I imagine that the squared shape is probably not the most aerodynamic shape out there, but it's good for maximizing interior space. Interior space is where it really shines. With all the seats folded flat, it can accommodate items up to 3 meters long and there are also tie downs in the interior for securing the items. It's like having a pickup truck bed with a roof. According to Toyota, the TJ Cruiser is designed for younger people who love the outdoors, something that they may use when driving their friends to a barbecue or to go surfing. While it's not specifically designed for off-road use, it is capable of that. The vehicle has a tough undercarriage and short front and rear overhangs for better off-road performance. It has 20 inch wheels with beefy tires. The scratch resistant coating on the hood is there to provide a durable surface to rest your tools and equipment. Uh, the TJ Cruiser is designed to be rugged, like the FJ Cruiser. Some have even called this the spiritual successor of the FJ Cruiser, but according to Toyota, it is not. The TJ Cruiser will most likely be based on Toyota's new global platform. The car on display was not just a clay model. It seemed to be a fully functioning vehicle with a fully functioning interior and, and drivetrain. Time will tell if the TJ Cruiser will get the green light for production. But I for one, and I'm sure many others at the show, would like to see it on our roads. Mm -hmm.